Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. I'm Lennon. Hi guys doing and welcome back to our room 2 Age of Bronze Let's Play with Egypt. So welcome to part 3 it is I believe. So let's get straight into it and let's see where we left things off last time. So I did m move the turn so we start on a fresh turn. Um, I put on this one so we get some extra uh, wealth from industry and we get some cheaper buildings which is all in all very much needed. Over the end turn, these guys also declared war on us, so we have the ability to just push uh, west as well. Um, so I kind of want to take this army and see what we can do with that. And that gives me a little bit more cash. Because you are basically free. There's nobody in here, there's only a 6 stack to defend. And we have a 13 and I kind of need that money because we have these guys are building up so I need to build up over here um, to get as much stuff as I can um, I do want to fight a battle this episode but this is just not worth my time That makes it more interesting. Can I build extra stuff here? Oh, I can. It's 500. Well, I could really use those. Um, and two clubmen. Yeah, that is probably the best way to go about that. Um, so either... These guys hopefully still taking attrition because they don't got anything that's producing food for them. Um, so either we push over this way or we circle back depending what these rebels might do to us. Mm, you're not my general so that doesn't really bother me if he dies because we are still Protected for two turns, okay. Um, we might take this city. We don't have enough money to deal with economy stuff, which is a little bit annoying. But let's see what the end turn brings us after we take on some of these traditions. Um, weapon damage inflicted. Heavy infantry, we don't really have that. Ambush battles, we don't really have that. Uh, we don't really use that. Two public order. It's raiding armies. Um, what does that bring us? Unrelenting force. I kind of want to know what did, what this is, but... Foreign territory. Um, let's go with this for now. Get, get a little bit of extra force in there. Le force. I mean public order. Diplomacy. Yeah, everybody still hates us. Saba. Don't want to have a trade agreement. No, okay. And once I do get a little bit more money, I want to send one of my generals overseas to the other side of the, the ocean. Yeah, maybe not. Who are you? Garrison army from Meshwesh. Oh, really? Okay, so there's your army. Um, let's pull you back to over here. Start you on defensive mode. So in the city I'll probably be able to hold them. Hopefully. Um, he's still building up. We are not recovering very fast. So I kinda... 
want to get as fast as I can. Get back over here. Um, Cause like he is not gonna go that, that way it seems like. And he's still taking attrition. Um, this might be a tough fight. That might be a really tough fight. Mm, and this might be a tough fight as well. Uh, so we have 9 and we have 13. Okay, so we technically do have more than them. We technically do outnumber them. They don't have a lot of missiles. Where we do have some. Six of them. Um, probably should defend this more than hey, two fronts. Let's see which one falls first. None of them. Okay. Now taking a piss. Because you want to go to Menifer. I can go um, over here in ambush, see if that works. 25% chance. But if he attacks, I do have the garrison army next to me. And if he does attack Manifer, we'll defend it, because it's a walled settlement. We'll try to kill as many as possible, and then we'll take the siege to them as soon as, I, as, soon as possible. Um, you're just waiting on your full on 20 stack, right? Tribesmen, Cushite bows, they all really overpower bowmen. There's not much I can do over here. Would like to have some more vision over there, but that's not something I have a luxury of. Okay, do we fight this? I'm a little bit reluctant. Um, no, I don't think I want to fight this. I think I'm, I'm sorry, but I don't feel confident fighting that. He's out of reinforcement range. See, this is one I kind of want to fight. So now we have 30, we have the upper hand, yeah. Ooh, a lot of forest. Those are only clubmen. I do have a lot more spears. Those bows are gonna be a problem. But we'll see how far we can take this. We do have some gar some uh, reinforcements. Where's my other chariot unit? Ah, probably that one probably died. Okay. Let's get those guys up front. Uh, let's get you guys. Probably should have you. Uh, 
Um, can we put you guys on loose formation? Do we have that? Hmm, no, we really don't. Okay. Uh, let's keep you over there. My reinforcements are from that side, so let's move a little bit more to this side, so we have our reinforcements closer by. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, this battlefield isn't too big. Our reinforcements have arrived. Okay, how do I want to do this? One, two, three, four, five. That is group five. Um, probably go like this. Slingers. And they're gonna be passive as hell. Okay. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna do like something like this and then group five is gonna be something like this let's see what they want to do problem now is they could overload this flank pretty quickly So our hidden units have been discovered. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. Yeah, okay, so why are you not there? Okay. Let's see. Is this if this line is full? If we try to pull them away a little bit from that fight, I don't believe is this line full in a tree still with. Yeah. Uh, let's get you over that way as well. Archers are here in front. Let's see if they want to pick a fight. Our hidden units have been discovered. So I think we just push forward. We overwhelm this flank. And you come over this way. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. Um, how many are there? Probably more than I can handle. Our hidden units have been discovered. Are we being fired upon? Yes, we are. My archers are firing back. Most of them. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. Okay, those tribesmen are gone. And including th two and three. Let's start moving you up a little bit further. And archers and slingers as well. 
Let's get a little bit more in range. You go this way. You guys go through the woods over there. Like these archers in this the archers in this game are absolutely nutty. We have discovered the enemy's hidden units. So we'll see if they want to take a fight. So we focus focus their archers. Those guys are gone. Nice. Oh, there's a general. Uh, target those guys. You guys flank around. If you can kill that general, that will be already a huge victory. Can we aim for the Kushite bows? Yes. And you're, yeah, you're being decimated by the Kushite archers. Okay, general is almost gone. That's good. Let's see if we can push him out entirely. Enemy general is dead. Great. Start pushing you that way. Um, uh, yeah, you guys can support this fight. We push over here. Okay, this is going pretty, pretty nice. Uh, you might need to push around a little bit more let's get you and guys into here as well we're boxing them in very nice uh you target the kushites target the archers and you target the archers as well and you go you guys target those as well. Target this way. Egyptian F3, yeah, you're... Uh, target that. My general is coming in here. Let's inspire this one, and they're gone. Uh, where's my chariots? Yeah, let's end it. That was that was a good fight. We lost 650, they lost 2700. See, these archers are absolute nutty. 363, 369, nice. 362, 286, 68, sorry. Even my general. When the hell did my general start shooting? <laughs> I don't even know. Mm, and we release them for a little bit of extra cash. Okay, that's them dealt with. Um, seven. It's nine. We have a lot more cash, so let's start threatening you up there. And just put some cheap ass units in there so probably won't be able to pay their upkeep but i probably should be able to beat you if you want to get over here and otherwise i'll beat you soon after mm. i definitely don't have the ability to upkeep those guys but Let's get rid of those guys, 98%. And do we have enough? No, but we can go over here. 
no, I need to re I need to replenishment, and then you can get that as well. Uh, so that's good start over there. Three k income over here. Um, no, 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 three k in the bank. This is giving me wealth from farming. So let's start build another farm here. Mm. And this is wealth from all commerce. Okay, that's great. And we're only minus 14 now. So we settled that pretty decently. And 12 that's cultural differences, which should be Oh no, I had the temple in this settlement. Yeah, no, okay. Um, let's end that turn. This Nubian army, yeah, could... You have recruited so many units, the treasury is buckling under the weight of... Could be annoying. So, he might be able to get here. But we still have a thousand men. So it might not even be that bad. Mm -mm -mm. Ooh, sanitation all regions, yes please. Um Oh wait, that was the wrong garrison. Oh I think we might be able to even to beat that like this. Um, I feel like he's taking attrition as well. Let's take this. Okay, so we definitely need to raise these guys. Get rid of that. Um, I think I want to go over here and just go an offensive stance that makes me a little bit more cash. Maybe even disband one of these tribesmen. Because those guys are hella expensive. Well, they're, they're not that expensive, but I just don't have a lot of money. Mm, I could do this. But... That would also... Up this. Okay, no. Ooh, honors, traditions... Yes, please. Missile units. And you could get assassinations. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. Let's start with assassinations. Maybe you can become a handy, a handy work. Do some dirty work for us. Trouble populace, yeah, yeah, yeah. Edom is destroyed. Oh, okay, he's healing. Might not be enough. Okay, so we to return ASAP to him over there. That is the same army that is taking us, but Menifer is a walled settlement. We do have 9 stack. Probably won't hold against these 20, but... Um, it's just fucking putting out fires everywhere. 
And it's just annoying that this is a just a, a game of tic-tac-toe, basically. Mm, go. Let's see if, if we can just... If we can deal with these guys, we have two armies. My Lord of um, okay, that takes out them. Oh, yes, we don't even need that. That deals with that fight. Great. Um, we enslave those. There is barely enough money. In so, yeah, we still need to get there to deal with them. That's the shitty part. Are we in the zone of control? Yeah, right now we are in the zone of control. So that is killing my money in. But we do have the reinforcements then. Uh, and we took peace with them, so that is great. This will kick their asses when we need them. Hey, that's a new one. Um, are you friendly with me? Would you like some trade? Nope. And... I could draw you out. It's 9 versus 10, I could probably win. Well, I just can't take on the garrison with it. And you're still minus 14, goddammit. I thought we had that settled. Mm, okay, one more enter for the win. And then let's see what kind of cliffhanger we get for the next episode. So by all means... Ooh, peace treaty. My people wish to offer you this gift of gold, if you will take um, it. Yes. Let us trade. You no. Should. Ah, shit. Raids in Anatolia. Uh, okay. You get back over that way. You can just die on your own and we'll pick off the scraps when you're done. If I go on over here, can I get to you? No. So that is where we leave things off for this time. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, please do leave a like on the video as it's greatly appreciated. Uh, give me a comment down below if you have any tips or tricks because I still got to need those. And by all means, do subscribe to the channel if you're having fun here as, as much as I am because I'm having a lot of it. So ladies and gentlemen, Thank you guys for watching, hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!